What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. Very rarely do we talk about abuse in men's relationships. We don't talk about that. We always talk about it with women, okay? We never talk about it with men, and we never talk about it with black men. And I want to talk about this because it's very uh, true. It's a very transparent thing. A lot of black men who end up with women, it could be the woman makes less or more money than that person, but you have a lot of black men that are in um, some, some, some really terrible relationships. Nice men too, okay? But in the case of the fact that you're dealing with a man who doesn't have a lot on his own, the woman has a lot as far as financially, you're going to see this man suffer, right? And I'm talking about there is very little that he can do or achieve in a situation like that. And that is exactly what Darius Jackson is. He's a young man who has not really established himself. He's a young man that really is not where he needs to be financially in comparison to Kiki Palmer. So, and a lot of brothers, we, we forget that there's two different sides of the coin. Just because you can make a woman attractive to you, and just because she sings your praises in bed, she says she loves you, you know, you're doing all of these things for her. You have not figured out something, and that is, does the woman respect you? Does she respect you? That is something that a lot of brothers have not figured out. Does she respect you? And again, a lot of us will 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 take all the booty we can get, right? But when it comes to your input being valued in the relationship, um, that woman don't care nothing about you, bro. A lot of black men don't want to hear that because a lot of us, all we care about for the most part is how good we can swing in the bedroom. You know, that's all that matters. How much we can make her holler. How many booty pictures she's sending us. And she can do all of that and not give a damn about you. But then when you want to be standing up as a man, when it's uncomfortable for her to submit to what you're talking about, that's the, that's the key. When I say something as a man, are you going to listen to that? When you don't want to listen to that, that means the woman clearly ain't respecting you. A lot of guys gonna learn that. Just because she's gonna do whatever you wanna do in bed, that's easy to do, all right? As a man, we need our respect. That's so easy to do, that's nothing. But now, when you ask her to do something that, re that requires your respect as a man, and she won't do it, she don't respect you. And how do we know that? Let's talk about what happened with Kiki Palmer and Usher. She went out there, she was wearing whatever she was wearing. The brother did not like it. Okay? He did not appreciate what she was doing. The brother went online and complained about it. She clapped back. You know, was pushing her little new clothes and everything else and all of that. She ain't got time to listen to him. And the sisters came for him. And, you know, he was going back and forth with people online and, Everybody said he was hating the brother and all kind of other weird stuff. I mean, it was really crazy, to be honest, all right? And the brother looked like, you know, it, he was going to break up with her. But the reality was that she was taking care of this guy. They got a baby together, okay? They have a child together. So it's probably very expensive, listen to what I'm saying, for her to just leave that guy like that. It probably don't make much sense for her to do that. So she didn't. Now they're back out there kicking and hanging out. Now they're back out there, you know, being together. Okay. They're being seen in the public. You're seeing the photos right now. But see, what you're not going to talk about is that this lady still don't respect you. And that's something that men 
have to understand. And it's something that I have understood. And it's something that I want you to understand. Because it is too easy for you to get in the bed and booty clap sound all night. That's easy for a woman to do. Because she's going to get horny. You know, it's, easy. it's almost like, you want to eat? Yeah, I want to eat. As eating is easy to do for somebody who is hungry. Okay. That's easy. That's very simple. That ain't nothing to be proud of. She's uh, she's having sex with you. She says she love you. That's easy. That ain't nothing. But now when it come to, hey, I don't want you doing this as a woman, and I don't want you doing X, Y, and Z, now she can't do it. Because she don't want, see, that's the whole point. She don't want to do it. See, see, let, let's, let's talk about it, black men. Let's have an honest conversation, black men. And a lot of y'all going to find out all y'all are is a penis of some lady in good looks and you smashing. But you don't get no respect because respect ain't got nothing to do about what you look like. Y'all haven't figured that out yet. Respect is... I don't want you to do X, Y, and Z. And because you respect me, you're going to sacrifice and you're not going to do that because I'm the man. Most of y'all ain't got it like that. Most of us ain't got it like that. So it's a hard thing because we work on looking good. We work on having a good game. And we make we, uh, women do things for us that we accept that's easy for them to do. Giving some, a man some booty is easy for them to do. Send you some pictures is easy for them to do. Come over all day and watch Netflix is easy for him to do. Don't wear that out there tonight. That ain't easy. Well, hold what you what you talking about? That they gonna fix their mouth. I don't want you going X, Y, and Z. Wear that outfit. Who you think you talk? See, 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 see. All of a sudden, oh, how about you make somebody a dinner? I ain't making you no goddamn dinner. Okay, okay. Now, now, now we having problems now. Hmm? You see that? Now all of a sudden we having issues now. Now it ain't funny no more, is it? It ain't fu it ain't funny no more. Okay, because now she can't do that. Then what y'all gonna do is she gonna come back and tell you, I'm sorry. They always gonna come back and tell you they sorry, bro. That's what they do is come back and tell you that they sorry. So you always gonna hear that. Always like out, can't see out, always like always. But if it ain't nothing changed about you from the time you got there till now, and you still in the same situation, you're going to end up getting that same thing a few months later, bro. It's only a matter of time. Did you think that she was going to change for you when she don't respect you? Is that what you thought? Is that what you believe, brother? Hmm? How many times y'all got to get y'all feelings hurt? To, to let you know the woman don't respect you like that. And I'm going to tell you like this. It's okay if she don't. If she don't, that's fine. I'm going to tell you one thing. Get her the f*** out of there. No respect for me. What I'm doing. No more access. Go, go deal with somebody else. Go do it. And he going to find out the hard way. She done went in there and moaned on him, baby, I'm sorry, I ain't gonna do it again. She gonna do it right again. She gonna let him know. This is my house. This is what I'm doing. Who the hell you think you are? Don't worry, it's coming, bro. And I've been telling y'all this for a while. Don't let the mouthpiece in the game and them hollering and screaming all night long in the bedroom make up for the fact that when you ask them to do something that's against what you want to do and they can't do it, that's how they feel. That's why they're not gonna do it. That's why they're not going to do it. You see. Be real. Because most of y'all been letting it slide. Been letting it slide. Been letting it slide. Oh, it's going to work better. She's going to be she going to be cool. No, she's not. And you back to the drawing board. Boy, before that lady ruin your life. You better run right now. While, like my like the old folks say while the blood is still running warm in your veins. Well, you better get up out of there. You better stop playing with these chicks. Stop playing with them. They don't want to do what they need to do. Why do you need to keep telling them? 
all they're going to do is go to, go, go to somebody else's uh, uh, a place and destroy it. Let me tell you something I, I, I saw the other day. I really like seeing this. I was, I was hanging out in Nairobi. Okay. And again, I'm very liberal, right? Hanging out in Nairobi just last weekend. I was hanging out with a South Sudanese sister and uh, a brother that was dating her. And uh, it was some men that were talking. And she wanted to say something. The young lady, and I swear to God, the young lady raised her hand. I'm like, what is she doing? Like, we're not in no goddamn school classroom. The woman raised her hand. I'm like, yes. She's like, oh, you know what? You know, you, you know, men were talking, you know. I just wanted to show some respect and I have something I want to say. I have never in my life witnessed that in my in my life. Never. Okay? I'm sitting here befuddled. But the the, the fact that the woman had that much respect for her boyfriend and for the men in the room. And I'm thinking about something. Not that I want somebody to do that. I need that. But it, 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 you, you're sitting around dealing with disrespect. And you have women out here giving men that sort of respect around the world. And I'm going to put up with somebody. That, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. She got to go. Absolutely got to go. Tonight. And he going to find that out. But it's better to get her out of there now than to wait later. So, guys, what do you think? It's your boy O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again. Another episode of The Celebrity Joe. Appreciate you for all you do. Subscribe to the bell. We're out.